I just want to. <laughs> I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be uh, chat up for most of the day, but I want to just uh, get this call over. Or I mean, not get the call over, but I don't want to to get this uh, set up here. Um, first of all, I am talking to an attorney Monday. You there? Yeah, I'm listening. I'm talking to an attorney Monday, and uh, obviously, old uh, Marty didn't obviously didn't talk to him. So. Good. I have no idea who Marty who Marty <laughs> fucking is. Anyway. So what are you? So uh, is this attorney going to be about the about the about the Markland case, or is this case is this going to be about Marty? It's going to be a whole ball of wax. Yeah. They got another person that does one ENT, another person does the other ENT. We're going to get down and uh, we're going to talk about the situation. You know, he Marty told me off the bat that it, it seems like that, you know you're going to have to go to the FBI. I said, I've already gone to the FBI. Oh, Jesus. In relate to that, that um, you know. But they said they basically that they, they should be interested in that. And I said, yeah, well, you would think they should. Yeah. But uh, it's been three weeks. I haven't heard of work. Yeah. Can you afford a good attorney? Do you have the kind of money to pay for an attorney like that? I don't have the money, but that's not the fucking point. If there is something there, um, you know, then, you know, it can always be passed around. And, uh, you know, I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm just testing the waters. Basically. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I can't hear. Now this uh, so is it Joanne Biggs, huh? Yeah, that's her name. Joanne Biggs. She's on Facebook. She's probably a kid, isn't she? George, she's a real woman, George. She's a real lady. I don't give a. She's probably a kid, well, a woman, but a kid, like in her teens or twenties. Um, how, George? Let me get. Let me go back to her profile again. I just said it a few minutes ago. But it's just a little disturbing that some woman is going to fucking. Um, I guess where I'm going right now, Cafe Couture. Oh. <laughs> Let me go to her. Where I'm, I've got a, my, my first uh, uh, thing of the day is Cafe Couture. So that would make me, hopefully she'll be around. George, she's got to be at least in her late, she's got to be somewhere closer to 50. She's got like teen kids. She's what? She has like teenage kids. Well, and she must be a simpleton then. I don't know. She went to um, Vanderbilt University, studied biomechanical engineering. Need, need, need I say more? Right in Tennessee, there must be a, a simpleton, uh, just a idiot. I mean, that's probably a bad, I mean, that's a, probably a pretty good school, George Vanderbilt. Well, then obviously they didn't teach her common sense, then did they? Well, she probably wasn't taught common sense in, uh, in frickin' the grammar school. That's when she was a little, a little kid. You know, how does people my minds work? How do people's minds work? They don't know somebody, and yet they're going to sit there and and to their and and you know and, and put themselves right in the drama. They're going to put themselves right in the fucking drama and not expect to, you know they're going to do that and not expect any consequences. No. Well, um. Well, they've got, no. This is a pretty pretty good school, George. They have a twelve percent acceptance rate. So for every hundred students that apply, oh, Al Gore went there, and Fred Thompson. Yeah, well, I don't, I don't. She, she obviously is fucked in the head. Sometimes she's got mental issues. May, it might, it might be both smart, but she's probably definitely got some mental issues. But as far as uh, whatever, being enlarged in, in a group like this, being fought in larger groups, if they can't see it for what it is, if they can't see what, what's going on, then they've got to be stupid. They have got to be fucking stupid. Amy Grant went there. Greg Abbott, the governor of Texas. So there's this a pretty prestigious school, George. Jay Cutler went there. Former vice Jay president. A vice Jay president. Um, the CEO, uh, CEO of American Airlines went there, George. Wow. A Nobel Peace Prize winner went to that school. So she must be really okay. smart. Former former hey, chief, um, a former um, U.S. Attorney General and a uh, Supreme Court well, honestly, justice. She, she isn't. She ain't that smart for her to be in, in, you know, in mixed up with this. I mean, all she did was say that she saw you. Okay. And what's the point of that? That's what they asked. The trolls asked her to do that. They asked everybody to do that. I mean, George, they really put a number on you, though. I mean, if you you saw those mm-hmm. posts, you know. But she saw me, right? Yeah. Saw me do, doing what? Doing, doing my work? Doing my job? Yeah. But they were, I mean, they, you know, if you would have seen all the stuff they posted, George, I mean, it's pretty memorable. I mean, that one picture of you with the red shirt on making that really scary face, they, they mean the shit out of that picture. They had, whatever. 
and they can't see that it's all a fucking uh, hatchet shot. Well, no one defended it. Nobody came to your aid. No other dad didn't did. know you. Yeah, but they deleted you, though. So they thought you were the one that was a troll. I think they made. I, I came up there, and, and I came up there and stated what they did in simple terms, and they deleted me. And yet they had they, it's a hatchet shot. They get they had the other people on there. Doesn't make any sense. I'm right here, Captain Katura, right now. Maybe she's there. I hope she is here. Are you going to contact her? Well, I'm going to. Yeah. I'm going to say first of all, ma'am, you need to you, you need to really know what you're talking about before you you know implicate people and start doing stuff. So I have a bird's eye view. Of what's going on, even though I'm blocked, and I said that this is a hatchet job. This is a, this is a uh, people are atta- hatchet job. People are attacking me, and for you to be um, adding to it doesn't help situation. Learn the facts before you um, before you attack somebody. So you're gonna you're gonna call her out and put her to put her to bed or put it all. Put no, I'm not gonna learn. I said learn. I said point blank. I said just just realize your you know what you're doing and and the attacks you make on somebody before you do it. Or try to get in, in enthralled in the drama yeah. when you don't even know what's going on. Yeah, they've been. Yeah, I mean, I'm. I mean, they. Let's just see if there's any more about you on DoorDash page. Because I'm thinking some of the people on there are fucking trolls. Oh, they're all trolls. I mean, they. I mean, they, look at they, every couple of weeks they'll post stuff about you. I mean, not recently, but they went real hard and. Um, I'm thinking there's a lot of fucking people that work for the company that are fucking fucking trolls. You think you think that uh, they, hard work. like in but the corporate yeah. office or like the other dashers? Obviously. I mean that would explain why your numbers rates have been going down. Yeah. I mean where else? I mean do you think they might have hacked your hacked the app or maybe even even like got like infiltrated DoorDash? You think Marty would even do that? I want to report it. I'm gonna have to do it again. I mean, George, would you even have, I mean, like, is DoorDash really the only company that, will, like, you can work for now? Or is there any other companies that are, like, better than that? Chris, what kind of question is that, man? I can work. I have a lot of skills. This yeah. is an easy job with okay. good money. Well, it's decent money. But what kind of question is that? I'm just trying to figure out why these guys are doing, George. I'm just trying to, I'm just. No, I'm what just they're to... doing is trying to sabotage my life. Yeah. They're trying to, they're trying to take, they're trying to destroy every. Yeah. Fiber of my being, but it's such a. But what I was, what I, what I, what I was trying to get at, George. I apologize for for the way I brought it up, but it's such a public job. You know what I mean? People can see you out in the out and about, so it's very easy for people for for them to get that knowledge and and, and kind of use that as a means to attack you. That's what that that was. Kind well, of I'm going to set this lady in her place. I'm going to yeah. set her in her place. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Um, anyway. Yeah, so did you get my message earlier about what I got that video? There's a video that I was watching that Mr. X sent me of Marty. Yeah, you got to watch it. About? It's about what executive outcomes did in the mid-90s that Marty was probably a general in. I want a picture of this son of a bitch. I mean, you can get videos. I mean, there's, there's, there's a, in the video, you can sort of see some of his, his allies and stuff, and they're just... I mean, there's a villagers that they 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 do shit to. They're showing them blowing up, you know, communities and torturing people. And um, there's a former, you know, I'm looking at his for the former CEO. You might want to. So how is how is President Clinton tied in with this son of a bitch? Maybe he, maybe Clinton's guys. Maybe that's well, that would be the connection, George. That would be the connection. Um, There's no way in hell that that, that that Bill Clinton would, I mean, would be tied in with that son of a bitch. I mean, maybe, I mean, maybe Clinton's guys, maybe there was guys with the CIA that, that made of clandestine operations that maybe helped fund those guys and maybe wanted to get control of the oil fields. I mean, you look at, comp- or not oil fields, but the diamond mines. I mean, you got De Beers, the big diamond mine company that controls almost all the diamond mines in the world. And a lot of the rebels are trying to overtake those. So maybe the maybe the De Beers lobby lobbied Clinton and the Clinton Foundation to send uh, CIA agents to help with and, and maybe just funnel some money to executive outcomes to help control that. Right. I mean, that makes sense. I don't know. I mean, these guys. I mean, all it, it's almost. I mean, like a lot of those movies that you see in the video games. 
they're based off of these guys, George. You know that whole thing of like art imitating life? That's exactly what this is. Fact is stranger than fiction, that's the same thing. I mean the amount of atrocities that Marty has probably committed I mean it's it's very much like, you know, war he's a war criminal. But he does it under the purview well, of a private organization that, you know, a lot of those well, criminal courts can't touch. Maybe somebody needs to investigate him. Maybe somebody needs to investigate every fucking move that fucking bastard makes. Well, here's the problem. Investigate every fucking thing he does. Investigate every fucking uh, action he takes. We got to, I mean, someone's got to open the investigation up, George. I mean, he may have ties. I mean, these military contractors, I mean, they go right to, I mean, the presidents have to sign off on these. You know, like Blackwater, in order to exist, they've got to be allowed to exist by the presidents. Yeah, but I'm not going to know every fucking degree of what's going on. I mean, going to know. Well, they play I mean, stupid, every... but they're like the they're they use these guys when they don't want to get their hands dirty. I mean, like the American, like we use Blackwater in Iraq and Afghanistan to do some of the things <laughs> that let's just say our our troops would be vilified for for doing. So they'll do the dirty work. It's like, oh, you want to go? You want to go get that? You want to get um, Abu uh, Al Zarqawi or um, you know, someone like that? You know, they'll torture. You know, our, 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 you know, our CIA is told they're not allowed to torture, but these guys know how to torture. I mean, they are, they are an expert in intelligence gathering, um, in, in extraction. Um, I mean, they'll do anything. You know what I mean? What's going on this morning on that RC? Um, that hold on, let me go on there. Yeah. Let me go on here. Let me log on. They can't see you on there, can they? No, you don't. You don't have to register a, a screen name to go on there. I mean, it's it's it, you have to do like a lot of stuff to be invisible. But I can I can view things, but I can't chat with them. All right, so I can go on there too. Then. Um, you could, but do you know how to do? Do you, are you? In, I mean, do you know how to use Darknet and other things? You use what you, you mean go on the dark web? Well, yeah, it, it, you have to go through IRC and you got to go through there's, there's like hundreds of servers and you got to enter the right the right transactional code. It's it, George, it might be a little above your. Um, I mean, unless you've got a really good computer and you've got. I mean, you it, it's blocked on a lot of servers. I mean, if you go... say again, um, it's tough, George. I mean, I I can keep sending. I mean, I can keep re- giving you the intel, but uh, okay. So Marty just said. Um, um, so, all right, there's a big document is going to be served to you soon. A big document. Yeah. A big document is going to be served to me. Yeah. In relation to what? The cases. Tom? To, um, let me see, let me see, let me see what he says. No, they're just, they're just waiting. Um, it's something about YouTube. And the judge's ruling about the copyright you have. The judge's ruling. Yeah, and how um you've been and oh okay this is what they're gonna go on Joy right they just they just Marty just said it he says they're gonna go after you for filing false DMCA claims because you don't have the right copyrights. Is that right? Yep. Wait wait wait. Is that what Marklin is, is, is going no, to do that in the that's case? What Marty is going to do. He's going to file because if you don't, ha- if you lose the copyright case, I think that's what they're going to do. I think they're going to say that if you lose the copyright case and you don't have the, all the, co- the legal copyrights, all those DMCA's you filed were illegal. No, not illegal. Not illegal. They can sit there and say it all they want. It's not. It's not fucking legal. 
Yeah, so that's what they're gonna go after you on, George. That might be a whole part of their counter suit with you. So who who's gonna counter sue me, Markland? Well, maybe not. I mean, well, I mean, it doesn't always have to be the the, the defendant to do the counter suit. I mean, I'm guessing Marty might have some other goon, maybe represent him. You know, represent the other goon, so Markland can continue making movies, and uh, just maybe bring charge maybe even bring charges himself or maybe his law firm can or maybe someone uh, a law firm he's associated with so that's why he came down here it's possible yeah to hire somebody to represent mark no to hire someone to maybe to go after you once this is all said and done because he was waiting as soon as the judge made a ruling on when the court date was so maybe the day after he'll file a suit against you if because maybe they're confident that you they're going to win and that that would show that you're maybe you know that they think that they're that would prove that you don't own the copyrights therefore um they can say that you filed false dmcas under... no no i have no samples of my work well that's that's what that i mean george i mean that's that's what they're gonna play like i i, I i'm not a, i'm not a, i don't really know much on copyright law so for the sake of argument if you lose which is what they're hoping that's what they're gonna do Samples of my work. Yeah, but they're gonna say though, if, if if let's say you do lose, which which got which you're not going to, but let's say somehow you did. Let's say they cor- they let's say they corrupted the judge or something, and the judge ruled or some stupid technicality like um, that, and that you know they win the ca- and then you don't own, and then it says oh you don't own the copyrights to the gorgeous George show or the trademarks or anything like that. No, I'm gonna take care of that. Yeah, but let's say okay, whatever. So let's say you do lose. They're going to turn around and say, oh, because you don't own the legal copyrights, um, you will, um, you know, there we go. Oh, some news came just, um, so Marty just made a joke saying, or not a joke, but if he says, if you send a DMCA notice that is both false and meant in bad faith, such as to harass or doesn't state a real claim, you have committed perjury. Though unlikely, if the party you sent the takedown notice decided to pursue this in a court, you would face all the consequences that your state imposes on you on people who lie in court. That's what they're going to do. Not lying in court. That's... I have samples. The samples are are solidify my work. So here's what so, they're, they're, so here's what they're going to do to you, George. They're going to try to beat you on the copyright claim. And if they beat you on the copyright claim, they're going to come after you for perjury. Because that will basic, because if the judge says you don't own the copyrights, then you'll be doing then you would have essentially have perjured yourself unintentionally. So that's what they're gonna play, George. So you've gotta win that case or you, or you might go to jail for perjury. I go into jail. I own the goddamn show. I have samples that have been sent to the law library in Congress. That's what they told me. Samples. All I need are samples of my work. Yeah. God damn it, so you've got to, so, so no. you've, so you've got to win that. You've I'm not going to jail. Are you insane? Well, that's what they're going to play, George. They're going to push for perjury charges on you for false DMCA claims. They can do all they want. So you've got. I to, own it. Well, if you won't win the copyright case, that's why you got to win the copyright case, so you can prove to them beyond a reasonable doubt that you own the copyright claim, that you own it. I own it. Okay, now here's and something. And I'm going. I'm getting the. Uh, the I'm getting the trademark as well. Well, he goes. Marty also says, he's 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 giving legal advice. He goes, if you sue someone for copyright infringement and attempt to harass that person and you lose because there is no infringement, the attorney's fees provide provisions may take effect and you may be forced to pay the other side's lawyer fees. They ain't paying nothing. Well, that's what they're saying if they win. And he doesn't have any. Doesn't have a lawyer. Well, what if he gets one? He can get one still. Yeah, so if you sue someone for copyright infringement in an attempt to harass that person and you lose because there is no infringement. Yeah, no, there is infringement and it is it's so fucked up. Well, that's it what that's what you've got to prove come January. So this is, this is, the stakes are even higher now, George. This isn't just about protecting your show and getting the money. This is, this could be, this could lead to some sort of counter suit and criminal charges if they if they there's get their no way. criminal charges what are you talking about the perjury charges george if they're gonna push there's for no perjury, perjury i own the show not if you not if the judge says you don't you got to persuade that damn well, judge I will appeal his, I, i'm ready to appeal his decision yeah well they're gonna push immediately for for that just to silence you i will appeal his decision immediately right after it yeah 
So they can do all they want. Well, if the judge, if the, yeah. if the judge is, is as corrupt and crooked as you think he is, he might just put, he might just drop the charges on you then, so that you're fighting both the legal charges and the and the appeal. Well, they 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 can't. They first of all, it's directed. It, it, look, situation is Markland does not have an attorney, and if he does have an attorney, we'll question all that. I'll tell you, that, you know. Anyway, I got walk in here. Um, yeah, Mark Luther doesn't have an attorney, so they're gonna they're gonna pull that shit from me. Well, you know, they can they can try it all they want. Uh, the perjury issue, there's no perjury because I do own it. The law library Congress told me that uh, all I need to do is send samples of my work. Yeah, but that's the whole argument. That, that's me the whole argument, George, is that if you did it with the intent, without without having a hundred percent, you know, a, a full copyright, and then if this judge rules that you don't, then you would have filed that illegally. Under file, no. penalty of perjury. Well, I have a no. I have listen. I have copyright, and the law library of Congress told me that I have samples that solidify my work. That's all I need to bring out. Oh, when wow. hopefully by then, when the trade when the trademark hits, you know, hopefully there'll be a trademark as well. Oh, this is something. And, 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 and if I if I fucking if I fucking drop the case, and they can't do shit. Then they can't. Um, I'm not a lawyer. I can't give legal. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, well, Marty just posted. Whoa, whoa, whoa! This is something Marty just said something else. George was given a chance for me to go away and leave him alone. He wants a day in court. I will make sure he has his day in court. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I will make sure his day in court for him is his perjury. Saunders signed his affidavit about doing all of George's work yesterday. And he's getting me copies of all the emails and checks and payments and information as well. Did you pay? Mar Did you pay Saunders? Because they're going to say. I get no. He didn't pay anything to Saunders. I paid him. Yes, I did pay him. And and so what? He can't yeah. prove anything. He's uh, not a fucking paralegal. Well, he's gonna Hold on a second. He, okay. He's not a paralegal. I paid him for whatever. I paid him. He tried that they, they tried that shit before too. So whatever. They can try it all they want. Yeah, so he's so basically Marty said again, I'm read I mean Marty was given you give you a chance to to to, uh, for him to go away, but you want your day in court, he's going to make sure your day in court is for perjury. And he emphasizes the perjury part. And he said, Saunders just signed an affidavit about doing all of George's work yesterday. So he's going to be... No, he hasn't done all my work. He so, hasn't done all my work. He was, he, he was, no, no, he didn't do all my work. Well, oh, let me walk in here. Yeah. I got to walk in here. Hold on a second. Mm. He didn't do all my work. He didn't do all my work. He was, he was a... Uh, he was a writer. He was a critiquer. And he didn't. He didn't. He was a critiquer of the work. Right, hold on a second. Yeah. Oh, got a wrong location. How you doing? I'm good. Yeah, we have uh, French toast and bacon, Katori mess, and French dip. Sir, what's the name? Uh, it's under, uh, under GM. Hey, we have a burger. A custom burger, medium. The fries, and then um, And then a Katori mess and a French dip. It says French dip. I don't know. Is, is, is your French dip a burger or no? Okay, that's fine. 
she knows about, or the person knows about it. Okay. Are you there? Yeah. So basically what he's got now, he's got Saunders to file an affidavit. Gonna he's gonna provide all the all the work you did and all the payment information, all, any checks, any financial records showing financial transactions between you and him. Um there were checks, but they can't prove anything. He was there to work to to as a writer. Well did you, what he was. Did you give him cash or did you write him a check? I would write him checks. Well, but that's gonna, beside the point. Well, he can get I mean, if he he can he can subpoena the court and then get those court uh, those those. I wrote him checks, but that well, you can't prove anything with those damn checks. I wrote him checks. I wrote well, him checks because, and, 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 because he was a formatter. Yeah, he but he'll, he formatted but, my documents. So what he did, but if he gets, all he did, but if he's testifying under oath that you that you know that there's that you paid him for legal services and you've got a he got a paper trail. That's well, what, then he's going to perjure himself. Then he's a son of a bitch. What did he? What would he perjure himself under? For lying. Well, if he's got evidence, he's going to perjure, him, he's going to perjure himself for, for a lying in the courtroom. Yeah, well, this for is lying Mar under oath. Yeah. Well, Marty wrote some more stuff. He goes, since the DMCA has criminal provisions and takedown notices, uh, notice senders must swear that their requests are valid under penalty of perjury. Filing a false one can reap criminal repercussions. So this is where they're going to go. This is this is their plan, George. This is exactly what their big plan is. And then Marty just said, George will learn the unique skills that I have and the legal co complications and ramifications it will now have on him for the rest of his miserable life. That's what Marty just said. Screen cap that. Um, Get it. Get it fast. Fuck. Fucking Dewey Manlove said, ah, oh, that's a great idea. Now it's gone. Okay, well, this is going to, now, this is, no, this is, this is listen, listen. I own the shit. I own the show. I have samples that were given to the Law Library of Congress. That's what the Law Library of Congress told me. I have samples that were given to the Law Library of Congress, and that's what the Law, Law Library of Congress told me they are of, of my work. Now, I'm getting a trademark. I'm going to be getting that damn trademark. Problem is, it doesn't. It won't be finalized in this order until 12 months. The case is six and six and a half months down the road. He can do all this huffing and puffing and blowing the blow, 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 blow all he wants. Okay. Yeah. So Marty just said, "Well, you have one op. Your option is to drop the lull suit against Will, but you won't do that." So I guess there's no alternative than to break you and put you in jail for uh, for perjury. Put me in. That, that, that's, that's, that's a crock of shit. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. So that, that's their plan, George. They're gonna try to they're gonna try to get in all the evidence to show that your DMCA claims are illegal. And that's what they're going to wait for. They're going to wait for the ruling on the judge. And then as soon as that judge rules, and if it's against you, they're going full bore 100% to get you on the perjury charges. Okay, well, not if I appeal it. I, I mean, George, it's very tough. I mean, how many inmates go to jail that, that claim they, they were innocent? I mean, every, everybody in prison thinks... What have I done? Place. I have done nothing. I protect my work is what I've done. Well, that's what they're going to say, George. This is, this, is, this is the whole plan, is that if you lose this copyright case, that will prove that you did not have legal copyright claims on those 
on those uh, videos. Therefore, when you try to strike those videos down for DMCA laws, you illegally tried to strike them under penalty of perjury. That's their whole legal plan. It is of my work. It is of my material. That's the bottom fucking line. I gave samples to the Law Library of Congress. All I had to do was get the samples to the Law Library of Congress of my work. Case in point, case closed. So That's... they can go ahead and blow smoke, and they can hop and puff and say they've got this and got that, and blow smoke. Well, guess what? Well, Marty just said something else. Work. The judge just made it very clear in the last order that is the, the if proof is if, uh, I'm sorry, and that if proof is produced that George has had any help with any of those pleadings, then the court will take full full uh, action against him. George forgets that Saunders will do anything to help us. Well, maybe if Saunders needs to go to jail for fucking uh, doing some shit he's been doing. Maybe we can find him, maybe investigate that son of a bitch. Now, he's done a lot of shit himself. Maybe his ass needs to go to fucking jail. So it's worded to drop against Markland, but it didn't say against Brennan, right? I mean, Brennan's all. I mean, they, they, they're all. They're all. It's. It, you know. It, it's blood in, blood out with these guys. You know. So Brennan. Yeah, so it, it's worded with Mark, but it didn't say Brennan. Well, Brennan's included. You know, it's blood in, blood out. I mean, once you're a troll, you're always a troll, right? There's loyalty to these guys. Yeah, but Brennan is not there to defend himself, and they can't do shit. They can't say shit. I get it. Yeah. So. I just That's hope where I'm going to go with it. At least, you know, at, least, at least you know what they're going to do now. So, you know, you might need to, I mean, start learning up criminal defenses for perjury. I don't know. And that's why he came down here to do what he was doing. Yeah, he's talking to all the lawyers, and he's going to bring maybe maybe possible civil charges against you. That's why he came down here to do what he did. That's now crystal clear that he'll do what he's trying to do. Yeah. Or he bought an attorney. Or he bought an attorney for, for Will. Or I mean, or, or maybe to file his own charges against you. I mean, did you ever DMCA any of his, any of his videos? Yes, I did. Well, there you go. That's what he's going to do. My, they're, they're, they're my fucking work. Well, if, if again, George, if you lose that, if you lose that copyright claim, then I'll appeal it. Well, not yeah. I mean, I hope the appeal ask is, is, is do appeals take longer than criminal charges? So you might have to appeal I, if you get if, if they get you on perjury, you might be have to you might have to be appealing while you're dealing with the. You know, you're you're sentencing in, in perjury. It's no sentence. It's no sentencing. I there's well, the no good, sentencing whatsoever. Well, the good there's thing no is, well, the good thing is, George, that a lot of those those uh, the the prisons have really good law libraries. So you can sit there and say this and say that and do whatever they want to do. It's brass tax is simple. Brass tax is that I own of I own the work. I own the work of the show. So they can sit there and say whatever they want to say. Said I perjured myself. Well, guess what? They sit there and say that I perjured myself. Well, guess what? No, I didn't perjure myself. Well, did when you file a DMCA claims, is, is there is there statements of penalty under perjury of false DMCAs, or is he just making that up? Scare us. I, I I've never really thought. I never really. I mean, yeah. I mean, I I don't know this penalty penalty of perjury. My I own the work. Well, that's what that's what the so, lawsuit. I mean, that's say. what that's what January. Um, that's what January is for. Oh, we got something new just came across the line. Stuff on the work. Stuff on. Yeah, I mean, but I. That's why you got to win. That's why. That's that's, an, that's why the stakes are even higher now, George. Um, because this isn't just civil anymore. It's, it could veer on the um, tier of criminal. But stuff on well. Pitts just posted something. He goes, "How funny that George will go to jail for perjury." All because he is too stupid to see that what he has done. Ha ha ha! I laugh at that fat cunt daily. That's from Stefan. Oh. Well, let, let him say it in my face. Yeah. Let, let let these people say everything they can in my face, and they won't be sent. Half these people run their goddamn gums, run and say whatever what they want to say. Let them say it in my face. Let them say half a, a quarter to sit in my in my face, yeah. and they won't have a face. Yeah. Oh, they're all they're all jumping on this. And they're all jumping on this now. They feel real good. They're all just making jokes about you. Marklin said he wants to maybe send this once this is all said and done. He's gonna maybe make a movie character about you. Maybe write a script and send it to some some you know about you. 
So what? So that's their that's their defense, huh? That that's an offense. That's gonna be their offense. Yeah, I don't know about that. That's whatever. That's their that's their defense of what they're going to be doing. Well, their offense is going to be they're going to be pushing the purge. The defense is that is that it wasn't copyright. Oh, and Alan just said something. He goes, "Imagine George in jail. Hopefully, he would hang himself." Oh, Billy Baxter just wrote something. He goes, hope George, I hope George likes the long showers. He could rub dongs with many, many guys every day he wants. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? They can, they can keep up and keep saying all this goddamn shit all they want. Oh, they're, they're, so they're, they're, the, they're... the one guy's... So made... when, so... Oh, go ahead. So when is this document supposed to be reached? Um, it might not come to you. I don't know. I don't know. But that's going to be what they're going to get you on, George. They want to get you on perjury. Get me on perjury? Yep. Uh-huh. So you're spending some time. They want, they, they, they want you to spend some time in the slammer. That's what uh, that's what Summers just said. Oh, and Baxter goes, how funny is it a guy that thinks everything against him is illegal will be the one spending the time in jail? Yeah, well, I'm not. That's, that's a bunch of shit. I'm defending my work. What I'm doing. Oh, somebody! I, I um, uh, Hamish just said maybe maybe Kristen can come in for conjugal visits, but she's already spent enough time in jail. She knows everybody. She knows all the inmates and prison guards by first name. Yeah. You know what, man? I'm, I'm not. Listen, listen. You 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 think this is funny? No, it's not. Funny. It's not funny. It's it's, not. it's it's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. They think it's. I'm funny. not. Here. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't, and uh, they can sit there and say whatever they want to fucking say. Goddamn problem is that they have created this shit. Mm-hmm. They've created all this fucking shit. It's one versus an army, George, and the army has a guy who fought in armies, who who, who wiped out armies. Yeah, I'm not going to goddamn what he's wiped out. I'm protecting my work. I mean, George, I really think we gotta fucking publicly bring up his 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 war crimes record. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. You see, I'm I'm lame basic right now. What I can do, what I can't. But you you can put a video. You can talk. We can talk about him, right? If we can do something with him. I mean, George, that resume needs to be exposed. I mean, we gotta put it out in the universe so everybody can see what kind of human being he was and is. Yeah. I'm like, I'm like, it's, it's all in timing right now. Timing right now is not the best. Yeah. So I'm, I'm just trying to figure this out. So they're going to try to flip it. Oh yeah, I mean they're going to go. They, 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 they said. I mean this is, this is what they've wanted, George, because they say. I mean the one, um, one of them just said, it's a shame he doesn't have any money. We could sue him for money, but we don't want all of his debt and, 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 and junk in an urn in the settlement. Um. This is of my work, so they can sit there and spit it all they want. It's of my work. Uh oh. It's of my fucking work, and that's then that's that. Well, so the then buck, they can go ahead and throw it. The bucktooth mongoose just said something. He goes, "Wait till the oh, judge." Oh, uh, here's what he says: "Wait till the judge sees the affidavit from Jamie's friends and family. They're gonna be fucking Jamie's. They're gonna they're gonna fucking bring in Jamie's family into this. They're gonna do what?" Bucktooth Mongoose just said, wait till a judge sees the affidavit from Jamie's friends and family. Friends and family? Yeah, so they're going to bring them into the case. What is they're going to bring who in the case? They're going to bring her friends and family. They're going to make statements about you. They're going to, George, this is going to be a huge trial. They're going to use, they're going to bring in character witnesses. They're going to bring people into your past to discredit you. This is going to be, you, you gotta, you gotta start calling. You gotta, do you have, you, uh, who are you gonna, do you have like witnesses planned? Like, do you, I mean, you gotta, you're, you're gonna be bringing this whole case. So you've gotta have like witnesses. Wait, 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 hold on a second. JB's parents have nothing to do with this shit. Well, that's what the Bucktooth Mongoose said. He's already talked to, he, he said he's gonna send an affidavit, he's gonna have them sign, they already got an affidavit signed from them. 
Jamie's parents have not a goddamn thing to do with any of this shit. They need to be left alone. Well, they're going to be involved. That's what they're saying. They've already got them to sign a legal doc, an affidavit. So now I have to... So wait, wait, wait. Do you believe that? I don't know, George. I mean... Yeah, the, George, this is a trial. They're going to, I mean, people are ruthless when, when, when the money in, in prison's on the line. They're going to do anything they can to beat you, George. And you've got to bring everything. You've got to bring the same level of diligence and, 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 and just passion and, and, and resources to this, this case, George. I mean, you've got to, you got to call, you got to call witnesses. You've got to get legal documents. You've got to have a whole legal, you know, plan of attack. You've got to test it. You've got to basically go in front of the judge. You've got to call witnesses. you got to testify. The Jamie situation is not entangled. It has nothing to do with this case. For know. them to even fucking say that is ludicrous. The That's Jamie what... situation has nothing. I dated the woman. We had we had our ups and downs, and I dated the woman. This has nothing to do with this case. So what the fuck is going on here? I don't know. Let me, let me see if I can see why they're doing it. No, well, because they're a bunch of idiots. Now I see what he's trying to do, though. He's trying, he's trying to just make up stories. Make up a fucking story. Yeah, but he doesn't care. Marty, why, does, why, does, why, do, why, do, why do they care? Why does he care? He, he's a, I mean, he doesn't think he's going to go to jail. So he's going to keep bringing up all their past, George. He's going to make every... He's going to bring up probably old guests. I mean, George, they're going to probably bring up... He's probably going to... They're probably going to call the, the, the station managers and probably going to have legal experts from YouTube and Google and all these other, um, you know, copyright experts and attorneys. I mean, George... Do you have any? I mean, do you have? Are you, are you gonna be like? Are you gonna hire any like legal like um like specialists and legal experts to testify? Hold on, just, 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 just hold on, just yeah. hold on, a second. hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta make a delivery. Yeah. Hold on, guys. This guy I'm going to is named Jay. Wouldn't that be something? Oh, his name's Jay. Oh. Yeah. Hold on a second. Give me one. Give me one second. Yeah. That'd be too easy, wouldn't it? Too fucking easy. Uh, give, me one, give me one second. Okay? Yeah. One second. Hello. All right. You had ordered some food. Yeah, I did. All right. There you go. Great. Thank you. Thank Thank you. Much. Thanks. Give me one second. Yeah. This has one has nothing to do with the other. They're going to bring up that Jamie thing that has nothing to do with anything and whatever. Jamie's situation has nothing to do with anything. What Saunders is doing, he's perjuring himself is what he's doing. He can't sit there, even if that is true. He cannot sit there and say it is. He can say it, even if it is true. He was a formatter. Okay? That's very ambiguous. It's very ambiguous to say what he did. He was a formatter matter of my document but so if he it, wants to perjure himself if he wants to perjure himself then we're going to we're going to make it, is we're, that we're going to bring up and we're going to bring out cps and we're going to tie in the fucking thing about his wife went to jail and how he was involved in that situation even though it was paid off he was involved and she gave him some of that damn money so we're going to tie that in we're going to talk about his huffer so if he wants to press that issue I'll, I'll throw him in the mix as well yeah. in the wood chopper. Now, is, I'll throw is, him in the wood is chopper. Now, now you can now are, when you file that under the pauperous thing, is it only an attorney you can't hire? Or are you allowed to hire legal any legal services? Once I hire an attorney, then it's look then 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 I'm not able to form pauperous. Once I do I hire an attorney, then I can't then have and it would take it out of pauperous. So that's the only reason why it's in pauperous because. You know, don't have an attorney or whatever, so, you know. Yeah, so Marty just posted something. Anyone who is, uh, this, is this is what he, this is one of the laws they're going to try to get you on. Federal, um, any person who with fraudulent intent places on any article of notice of copyright or words on the same 
purport that such person knows to be false or who with fraudulent intent publicly distributes or imports for public distribution any article bearing such notice or words that such person knows to be false shall be fined mo not more than $2,500. That's 17 U.S. Code 506C. So they're going to try to get you on that as well. They get take take your money, you know, to go to, to kind of deplete your resources. They can do whatever they want to do or try to do or try to come up with some kind of cockamania, whatever they want to do. The, the brass tax is they're not able. I mean, they can they can look if a pig. I mean, if a pig had wings, it could fly. Mm -hmm. um, if they can, you know, if a if a, if a three legged dog had a fourth leg, it could probably stand up straight. Uh, you know, it's just, you know, it's just basically what they think they can do and whatnot. And it's just all speculation. They can sit there and say, well, it's this, that, and the other, and I did this, and he did that, and blah, 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 blah. Bottom line is, I have samples of my copyright, copyright work. That's all I need. Samples of my copyright work, that's all I need. What I'm going to do, when is this going to drop? When is this uh, thing going to drop? I don't know. I'm just, I'm just logging. I'm just checking. Right, right. They just had a ch edit, just check an email. Um, I'm just waiting for them. Let's see if I can see anything. God, this fucking Marty. Fucking killing kids. I mean, I'm more upset about his actions in the past, murdering people, than a lot of than. than... Well, well, we know that. We know he's got a checkered past. We know yeah. that. We surmise that. Yeah. But you're more upset about the trolling than though. Um, we, yeah, I mean, it's fucked up. Yeah. But uh, I'm concerned about my situation. Yeah. So, yeah, so his past is, is not nearly as bad as his future. No, it's, it's, a, it's a body of work, no doubt. Yeah. But you can't, you know. <laughs> oh. You can't really. Okay. It just said, okay, well, backed off of this. Um, it looks like the documents are going to be finished um, by the weekend, during the we over the weekend. The documents are going to be what? They're going to be finished this weekend, and they'll probably be mailed out soon. So you should probably you might be getting them, or they might or they might just go right to the court. I don't know. They might not even go to you if they're playing a different boy. What are they going? Wait, wait. So they're going to go to me, or they're going to hold on to them? They're probably well, they're going to probably send them to a different, maybe a different court, maybe a different jurisdiction. I don't know. But he said they're going to be done this weekend. So what? So they're going to send it to a different court? Or possibly. Maybe there might be. They might. They might. Maybe they might go judge shopping. It's only one court they can send it to. Well, did you, if, if if well, YouTube is located in California, so that might be their ploy because you filed a copyright with 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 Google and who's located in I believe outside of San Jose, you know, Silicon Valley area. They might make, they might bring the charges there, and then force you to go to California. Yeah. I don't know. Any, I don't know. Just bullshit. I mean, would you? I mean, it's expensive there. The fl I mean, I don't know what the flights are, but that's probably what they're going to try. Well, to I, do. I, look, look, look. I've, I'm not going to sit here and speculate and and do whatever. Um, they're going to still do, they're going to still bring up shit or whatnot. I can, um, how do I play this? God damn it. How do I fucking play this now? I don't know. This is, this is, this is, this is, um, this is fucked up. Unbelievable. This is all, all being said right now. Yeah. This is their legal, this is their legal discussion. Yeah, so they might um they might try to get this and you know where Google so where you filed who actually so I mean so where the actual copyright claim went through so it went through the you know the Ninth Circuit and um so they'll want to go there so that they can um that's what they're playing and then they just said oh Marty goes oh and then we're also talking about we're also planning on making George produce copies of every show you've ever done and that the judge has already told judge he has to uh the george has to produce the evidence so they want every episode of your show to prove that you own every one of them do you have every one on tape 
I have what I have, but I don't. I'm not going to go that route. I have not if it comes through discovery. I, I, I have samples that I gave to the Law Library of Congress. I'm going to have to. Um, I'm going to have to get this uh, out of his courtroom. Yeah. What I'm have to do. Yeah. And reopen the defamation. Well, you might have to go to California. Because that's where Marklin and Brennan are, and that's where YouTube is. So you must probably travel back and forth to California, speak, you know, do everything there. No, it's being well. No, it's being done here. Yeah, but like if they do the change of venue, you know, you might, you know, they might ask for that. They might think that it's unfair because you may have been able to corrupt local officials. You know, it's like it's like they they might play that game. You know, that they might not think they can get a fair trial in California. And then with YouTube being there, mm-hmm. and that's where the def- that's where the DMCA claim went through their 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 court system in California. That son of a bitch! I own the work, the samples that I own. They're samples. They're samples that I freaking own that were given, and that's all. Told to me. Now, if that's not true, well, that's all right. Mm-hmm. Bullshit. Son of that son of a bitch. So he wants to go that route, doesn't he? Huh? Yeah, I mean George. I mean these these guys have a lot, they have all the money in the world to 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 to, to do to win this case on you and punish you when it's over. They want to make an example out of you for fighting the internet. Oh, damn, I don't want to fight the internet. Damn, right, to fight the fucking internet. It needs to be policed. Well, that's that's why they're fighting against it, George. The internet was much more effective when it was the Wild West, and now all these corporate interests and anti-bullying things are ruining it for a lot of people. So that's why they're so vehement against it, George. George, you used, again? well, uh, off topic, back to something else. Um, George, what, do, you, do you use Twitter by chance? No. Well, because they've been, they've been hitting up the DoorDash uh, Twitter and trying to talk shit about you on their official Twitter page. So you might want to start getting on Twitter and defending it. Who's doing it, Marty? Who else? Who else? Yeah, Marty and who else? Just, it, so far, it's just Marty. I mean, why? You know, George. I mean, Marty. There's no consequences for Marty. I mean, when you've mur- when you've when you've committed acts of war on third world children, do you think he's got any fear of of going to jail over? Of, of this type of stuff. That's why he's so bold, George. When you've wiped out villagers and bombed, you know, hospitals and all this other stuff that those guys have done, this is just child's play with Chucky. So how do I play this then? I don't know, George. I mean, I've never dealt with foreign mercenaries with who have ties to the U.S. government and shadow ops teams. So even if I do drop the damn case, this is this is that's gonna work against him still. I don't know. I mean, that, I mean, do you expect to win a lot of money from this case? I don't, not with this judge, no. I have zero zero with this judge. So maybe we better to do a change of venue, go out to California, because you know California is super liberal, so they might actually be more sympathetic towards you. I want to reopen the defamation. Maybe get under the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. You know they got all those anti-bullying laws out in those blue, those really blue states. So I wanted to reopen the defamation. But then what might hurt you in California is they're super liberal, and not, they might bring, they might play the gay card with you. You know, use it saying that you know a lot of your statements are homophobic, and you get to go to San Francisco, and a lot of those everyone's gay out there. So that's what they, that might be their other play. You know. I thought I would have like a little time to think about all this stuff to be put on the back burner, and there's and and they're revving it up right now. Yeah, they know that, George. It's a full scale assault. Again, this is what Marty did in the past. This is this is his specialty: pressure, manipulation, lying to people, p- buying people out. I mean, to him, Sarah was just another rival tribesman, and just gave instead of giving him a jewels or like a sacred amulet or something, it was just a, a cash. It was just a you know a settlement. So I'm giving them a license to fuck with me either way. Probably, yeah. But now they want to go after you criminally, so. Yeah, good luck with that. And they might, I mean, they're, I mean, they might go after you both criminally and civilly. 
And they've got the money and attorneys and the patience and the drive to do it. Uh, they can do all that. They can sit there and do whatever they want to do. I mean, good luck with all that shit because the bottom line is, I this is my work. They murked up my work. Yeah. So even if I drop the case, that's not going to stop it. I don't know. I mean, I hope it would. Well, I'm going to drop the goddamn case. My work is being fucked with. I mean, you know the judge doesn't like your show, so it might be tough to persuade that too. Even I mean, he did bash your show on the on the on the court document. That's why I don't. I have zero credit, and zero faith in this judge. I mean, would you? Would you? What would your? What would your appeal be on that? Would that your show is actually masterpiece theater? Or is that? Uh... It's not his. Not really for him to, to say one it's way. Not, or the it's other. not the judge's judge. It's not the judge's job to judge. It's not the know. judge. It's not the judge's. Uh, uh, not the judge's interpretation, but see, there's a jury trial. Basically. So the judge shouldn't judge on anything. I make sense. Okay. There's a jury trial on this thing too. Yeah. Which, which so then you've got to persuade all the judges that your show is copy deserves to be copyright. Well, no, I don't have to persuade nothing. That is the point. George, you have to persuade that the burden of proof is on you as a plaintiff. It so doesn't yes. matter if he thinks my show is not of whatever. That's not the fucking uh, the crux of the case. You understand? Yeah, I do. I'm just playing what they're going to be playing. Huh. But it's not the crux of the case. Yeah. So they're going after you on every front, George. And I think that's that's why this is so wor- this is what their plan is. They're going to go you after you legally. They're going to go after you, like in your social life. They're going after your your professional career. They're going to go after your personal life. They're going to bring up all your secrets, so that when you walk into that courtroom in January, you're going to be so confused. You're going to be dealing with so many things. Yeah, that you're going to forget about the case, you're going to neglect certain things, you're not going to provide certain docs, so that they'll just be able to say, oh, the, the, the plaintiff didn't file this, this, and this, he didn't bring this, this, and that. And then when you've got it, when they've got their whole team of lawyers and their team of legal experts and forensic, and, um, you know, people and legal experts on copyright laws and Google representatives, and it's just you versus all them, that's gonna be tough. That's their plan, George. I don't, I don't, yeah, they, they, but they can't, yeah, bullshit. Not, they're you, not doing I mean, are bullshit. you going to, are you going to hire any, league, are, are, are you going to, like, do you have, like, wit, are you planning, like, hi, like, getting any witnesses to testify for you? Well, I have the witnesses. Yeah. I have the people. I mean, they might actually, they, I mean, knowing Marty, he's probably going to hire someone from, you know, you might have some people from Google come in to testify about the legality of your copy, of your claims, and. You know, they're gonna, he might have fair use experts, and they're going to use case law. I mean, it's going to be a it's going to be a full on assault, George. I know you're, you know, it's going to be a, it's going to be a. I wouldn't know how to deal with that. I hope you're ready. Concern him anyway. He's not on the goddamn case right now. Well, it doesn't concern him, but he's made it about him. He's made it all about him. It doesn't concern him. He's not on the damn case. So what's he trying to do? I mean, whatever. He doesn't. He, you know, it has nothing to do with. It. He's not an attorney. He's not. He's not an attorney. So that way, he's paid for his attorney. He's paying for this guy's attorney, basically. Yeah, he's doing everything. He's doing all legal. I mean, he's paying for everything. He's the mysterious benefactor. I'm going to have to, uh, I'm going to have to figure this shit. I'm going to have to think about what I'm doing. I don't just want a lot of, uh, a lot of fucking crap. My right, phone is up. Okay. Let me, uh, I'm, I've got another order I got to do. Yeah, me, I'm going to um, get going. I got to, I got to go, I'm going to go to the gym a little bit and start my day, so. Uh, maybe we'll talk later tonight or something. Maybe or, or if you're anything. Yeah, I will talk to you um, later on. All right, I'll talk to you later on tonight. Okay. Have a good night or day. All right. Bye. All right. All right.